What's up everybody, Young and Hard here, and welcome back to another episode of The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. We are going to continue on with the Beast of the White Orchard quest, so let's talk to Vesemir. Yes? What is it, Wolf? Been busy with the Griffin contract. And? It's time to set a trap. I'm ready. No point in waiting. Let's find a good spot to ambush it. Picked one out already, other side of the stream. There's fields and a grove. Plenty of room and... Far enough so no one will get in our way. Good. Me there. Alright. So, prepare to fight the Griffin by brewing Thunderbolt Potion. So, let's do that. Uh, let's go to the alchemy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I understand how to brew potions. It's not hard. Th Thunderbolts. There we go. No, I don't want to create another one. I want to brew... This one. There we go. Alright, we got our Thunderbolt potion. Let's get the hell out of here. And go kill a griffin. So all the Thunderbolt Potion will do is just make our attacks do a little bit more damage. Which will be very useful. A stream, amber waves of grain, charming place, perfect for an ambush. I know how to choose them. So, ready? Let's start. Wind's good. Bait's scent will spread quickly. Now all we have to do is wait. Come on, we can cower in the shade of those birches. So tell me, once we find Yennefer, what'll you do? Got your eye on a contract? No. I'll go to Cam Moore. Little early to settle in for the winter. Snows are a way off, yes. And that's what worries me. Nilfgaard's crossed the Pontar in the east. Puts them maybe a week's march from Cam Moore. If they reach the valley before snows can cover the passes, well, we need to cover our tracks, hide our paths. Speaking of winter and wintering, think you'll come this year? Maybe. Might bring a guest. I love the bait they're using. Just a little fake toy lamb. Hear that? It's close. That's Let's it, you dumb griffin. Wait. Take this. A crossbow. Won it in a card game while you ran around. Might come in handy. How about that? Always lectured us on the evils, but you're a gambler yourself. Stop talking. Got a griffin to kill. <laughs> oh, Vesemir. <laughs> the griffin's like looking at it going, What the hell is this? Alright, so we'll equip this. And we can line up. It's about to dive. Oh yeah, it might help if I take my potion. Come on, Griffin. I'm gonna call you Peter. It's gonna be Peter Griffin. Yeah, well, it's on fire now, Vesemir. Ah! Damn it! Come on, go! So hard to aim the crossbow. Don't let it get 
get away. I ain't letting it get anywhere. You're the one letting it escape. I'm chasing the thing down on foot. I don't need Roach for this. Although, I will eat something on the way. Might regen some health just in case. Did die, you son of a bitch. There we go. And just to be sure. <laughs> not bad. Not bad. Though you could stand to improve some things. Like what, Vesemir? For example. Upward vertical strike, it's too obvious. But more on that later. Take the Griffin's head to the Black Ones, I'll ready our horses. Meet me at the inn. Alright. Where's my looting spot? I can't see it. Damn it. There we go. Wasn't even anywhere near the griffin. What the hell? Alright. Yeah, let's go. Alright, so now what we gotta do is just take this back now. Obviously we could ride there, but screw that, I'm fast traveling. I need to make this longer than it needs to be. We need to go around the back anyway to get in. The Emperor shall guide us straight to Novigrad. What the hell is this? Why? You take me for a blind man or a fool? This grain is rotten. I... I didn't know. So, a fool. Damn it, you never learn. Military Codex, Article 2, Section 3. For the delivery of defective goods, 15 lashes with an out. Make it so. Oh, no, no! By the gods, no! What? It's not his fault. Oh, I knew you weren't reasonable after all. <sighs> what? Guess you've dropped your good uncle act. It was no act. I extended a hand to these people. They spat on it. Could it be because it held the sword that killed their loved ones? Tja, a moralist. And what would you do in my stead? Wouldn't ever be in your stead. Tell me why you've come. Killed the griffin, bitch. Fulfilled my end of the bargain. Your turn. Where'd Yennefer go? To Vizima. She was a day's ride from here the whole time. Under my nose, might have said so. Yes, I might have. But you would not have killed the griffin. Tit for tat. Halt! We are not done. He's got a point there. This gold. I would not want you to say you were inadequately compensated. Okay. Some dialogue demands you to make a quick decision. Choose your reply before time runs out. I'm turning down your coin because you're a dick. I'm insulting you. Yeah, that's right. You look insulted. Oh shit! Is it true? No more, more than one. Oh, please, no more. But once every three moons. What an odd thing! Mercy. Yes, wish. Will someone explain to me why you are here? All of a sudden, he's just become a random Nilfgaardian person. Oh, lovely. Alright, let's level up. Um, we've got two points to level up now. So... We can finish leveling up 
delusion or we could go fire stream so emit a continuous stream of fire that damages enemies stamina regeneration in combat is increased hmm I don't know. Do I want to do fire stream? Seems like it could be good, but at the same time, I kind of need to do some actual damage. You know, let's just we'll level that up. Why not? It's full. We have the most dialogue options we can get. And then our mutant gen should sync up nicely with these two now. There we go. Alright, let's head back to Vesemir. Alright, let's go talk to Vesemir. If our horse easy. will get the hell out of the way. Jesus, Roach, come on. What are you doing, buddy? Yennefer's in Vizima. Got a few friends there, so... Something wrong? Look around. Trouble brewing. Oh, joy. Time, Time to go, then. On our way. Mm -hmm. I'll buy some provisions for the journey. Then we'll go. Geralt, we should stay out of it. Just this once. Probably for the best, but knowing us, we won't. What happened to the lilies? Took them down. Took them down? To hang a golden sun there now? To not get killed. I cannot show Tamerian colours. They'll come and burn the tavern down. Maybe it's true what they say. You fond of the Imperials? You Nilfgaard's whore? I'll let that pass. I know grief eats at your heart. You know shit. They hang my sister, dragged her out the cloister like a dog. Said Nilfgaard's no place for superstition. That they don't fear the wrath of the gods. And you, do you fear it? If not for Annie, your child would have choked on its navel string. You owe your son to Let's my sister go. to the birth, and you don't fear the gods' wrath. You don't fear it, you cunt! Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Why are they shoving... Like, oh, come on. We're protecting, like, Reckon their bards, mate. And they're you going nuts. Oh, fucking assholes. You all right? They say witches steal young'uns. That's true. What'd the Emperor promise you, freaks? Your own land? Like he did the elves once? Get out, all of you. We ain't going nowhere. And neither are you. Oh no, you have you clubs. I can see that. I'm so scared. There we go. Oh, shit. It's all right. It's over. Leave me be! Get away! You started it. See his face. God save us. Be gone. And don't ever come back. Really? Even she- we saved her life and sh oh, fuck you. So much for not getting involved. Come on, let's go. Vesemir was the one that started getting involved, not me, let's just be honest. That brawl, we didn't start it. Hello, gorgeous. Excuses, excuses. You've not changed a bit. 
Y Yen? How? I received a report about a witcher who'd appeared in White Orchard. I knew it was you, looking for me. I might have waited until you found me, but... Well, you know me. Patience has never been my strong suit. It's... Good to see you, Geralt. I... I'd even embrace you. Were you not covered in blood? Sorry. Wasn't expecting to see you. To be honest, this isn't at all how I imagined we'd meet. How did you imagine it? He didn't imagine you'd have a Nilfgaardian escort. Don't get me wrong, Yennefer. I'm glad to see you. But I do think you owe us an explanation. And I shall provide it. In Vizima. Ready your horses. Hmm. We can talk here. Some charming orchards nearby. In bloom even, so you almost can't smell the corpses. A tempting proposition. Sadly, I must say no. You almost can't you smell the corpses. You in Vizima. Someone who doesn't like to be kept waiting. Emperor Emir Var Emrys. Or, to those on more intimate terms with him, the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Or as I like to call him, Tyrion, uh, Tywin Lannister. For as I remember, <laughs> last time we saw each other, he wanted to kill me. Well, now he wishes to make you an offer. The kind one can't refuse. I didn't, though I could have. Hmm. Fine. Guess I'm willing to hear him out. The Emperor of Nilfgaard, Lord of Metina, Ebbing, and Gamera, Sovereign of Nazare and Vicovaro, will feel honored, I'm sure. What about you? I'm going in the opposite direction. I somehow doubt the Emperor's invitation mentioned me. Besides, I've got things to do at Kaer Morhen. Remember? Yeah, I remember. Thanks for your help, Vesemir. See you soon. How's your horse? Swift? Can't complain. Why do you ask? I'd like to be back behind some thick city walls as soon as possible. I wonder why. Bye, Uncle Vesemir. I'll miss your thick, croaky accent. You know, I had a dream about you recently. Knowing you, it was probably filthy. Just the beginning. But then... But then? Uh-oh! Right Time to run! Wild Hunt's coming. Shit. Like they can't jump over that gap. Don't get me wrong, I'm happy to get away from the wild hunt. But they could have jumped over that. This tomorrow, all right? After the audience. It's never a good thing when the wild hunt appears. This bard's tale begins near White Orchard, with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore, the sorceress Yennefer. She'd eluded him for years, but now seemed just a few steps ahead. After many trials and tribulations, Geralt finally learned that Yen was in nearby Vizima.